partners in Crimea. Um, uh, can you show the slide? Because of all the organizational issues to talk with every and each of you and to extract your knowledge, your understanding of what's going on. But I'm so happy and proud that you are here with us today, that we made it, and I'm sure that we will think about all of those things that were told on this stage, and I'm especially proud with the latter panel. Uh, that was fantastic and that brought lots of attention, even though it's the last panel, but it was really very important. And I think that it should be just the beginning, um, and we will think how to process it all. But I think that so many, even more than I thought initially, things that unite us with every context of every country that was presented here. And we should more work on this more. And I feel like the main, maybe the main thing about this conference is that Ukraine is getting our subjectivity, right? So thank you for this, for this feeling. This is fantastic. And I'm sure that it's not the last time that we meet. But next year, you know, please get prepared to travel to Crimea. Thank you so much. Thank you, dear colleagues. Uh, there is, there is uh, no time for closing remarks, but uh, we do think it is better to have uh, more space for questions, for discussions. And thank you to all of you who were with us all these uh, three days. Our conference covered uh, many, many issues, uh, starting from uh, food security, Wagner Group, uh, energy infrastructure, international justice and human rights, uh, uh, left uh, ideologies and how they reflect uh, Russian invasion to Ukraine and many, many others. We hope that every one of you found uh, something interesting uh, during this conference and uh, many thanks for those who were with staying with us all these uh, three days. Uh, and especially to the guests who travel from many countries uh, which are thousands and thousands of kilometers from Ukraine. For us it was very challenging. We did this uh, format of conference for the first time. We had several co-organizers uh, and we hope that it is not our last conference. We hope that next one will be in Crimea, as my colleague uh, Maria Tomak said. So uh, we welcome all of you to discuss uh, maybe post-war future uh, of Ukraine. And uh, we were enriched with these discussions and with experience uh, of our distinguished speakers from uh, Latin America, from Africa, from Asian countries. And we also hope that uh, these uh, uh, days in Ukraine also helped you to understand Ukraine and Ukrainians more. And we are very grateful for all who worked to make it happen, uh, for our uh, teams, for volunteers, for interpreters and special thanks to our donors without whom this conference would not be possible. Thank you.